my phone's here. Unfortunately, I don't have a tutorial today. Hopefully, get it up tomorrow or Monday. But I wanted to just do a late introduction for this for the series we're doing right now. So I want to show you what the end result will be similar to, and let's show it right now. So essentially, it's a kind of beat 'em up type fighter. So let's show it. Now here you have a basic attack that you see all the stats. That's not all the hits that it does. What I did was made it a separate affix for each of these, but each of them has a, a stat watcher on them. And essentially, this one works on a, that, that one works on that, that one works on that. There, the first one works at like two point, uh, zero points, two point, eight, six point, eight points, ten points, and things like that. So. I mean zero, two, four, six, eight, and they don't all add up. So it's all separate. But the way the system works, it's gonna show all of it. So let me show you the attack. This is the first attack. Oops, my bad. <laughs> this is the first attack. It's using the eviscerate animation, and. I remove the wolf so they'll look a little different. Then let me turn on God mode so that I can uh, do continuously. So right now it's just that. It uses the attack animation. So if you equip a weapon, it'll use the the uh claws the attack animation. But the combo counter, which you see right here, which is a stat we put onto the player, does not count until it hits something so I'm gonna spawn a punch bag and set the pity passive now I'm gonna hit it and you'll see that it has a different attack each time and the combo counter goes up and resets when it reaches 10 let me just show it like that. there you go I made the last one look looks no no difference to that you can tell it apart. Now, what I did different though is that I added this skill. That this skill right here only works when you have the last yeah you, know, you have eight points. Now I left the description and stuff alone. I just changed the names so I can see it. And I just left all the stats and stuff by itself. So this skill requires eight points before it works. So I'm gonna just right click right now. It's not working. So I'm gonna put eight points onto my fighter. Three. Okay, eight points. Now there you go. And you can't do it again because it's set to reset back to zero after the hit. So essentially this class that we're making is going to have a bunch of skills that are like this one that combo up and you can do this. that will change each hit like that. Now I left the uh, charge, charge UI alone. I didn't, that didn't change anything. I just did engineer's charge bar. So this is how the skill works. Now what I'm thinking is we can also do something a little unique. We can make it so that at one point, it will do a different attack, so that you can let the meter go down one point, and then boom, different hit. So we can have like a fun little combo system for this class. And then we could have some these attacks, which we'll, we could use to generate charge and things like that. To, so we implement the charge system into this class as well. So that's the layout for our class. So essentially, I'm going to explain a series that we're going to make for this class. So I already did the first episode of the first series, which was just creating a class that doesn't really have anything in it yet. And in the second episode, which I will hopefully get up by Sunday or Monday, we'll do the stat, which is this one right here, the combo counter. And in the third episode, we're going to make a skill. And then the second series, which is still going to continue this class, is going to go into more intermediate stuff. Like actually creating a custom skill, creating a custom particle for the skill, 
create a custom mu missile for the skill and things like that. And then the last part, last last series is gonna be cosmetic things like animations. Well, I can't do animations because I'm not good in that. Changing textures and all that stuff. So there's the plan for this series that I'm gonna make, and I promise I'll get a video up by Monday on the stats, and then after that, I'm certain I could get a the third episode on Wednesday. So. There's the plan. There's the class. I'm just gonna show the combo one more time. One, two, three, four, five. Or one, two, three, four, five. Like that. I'm taking advantage of the uh, skill queue system. So, essentially, one, two, three, four, five. I have to change the uh, the there's a little there's a setting inside the skills that allow you to set the period that you have for the for the buffer. So I didn't mess with it, so it's a, so it's kind of unfair right now. <laughs> so there you go. This is what we're gonna make, and hopefully, I promise I'll get the video up by Monday. So have a nice day, and I'll see you on Monday.